she's a wife, she's a mother, and she's a breast cancer survivor like me. Please uh, join me in welcoming Dr. Marisa Weiss. It's really a privilege to be here today. I'd like to thank the Business Clubs of America for providing this opportunity to introduce you to breastcancer.org. And a special thanks to Kistler Tiffany Benefits for selecting breastcancer.org as today's charity spotlight. I'd like to turn your attention now to the video screen to share the stories of eight amazing women who came together to share their personal stories about their experience with breast cancer. The only thing that comes through in your brain is cancer. Everything else is wah, 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 wah. I received my diagnosis four months after I gave birth to my second daughter. We're also very proud because breastcancer.org was started in the Philadelphia area. We benefit the world. We're part of the success story of Philadelphia, and we're grateful to all of you that have helped us get there. When you find something like Business Clubs America and Kiss Their Tiffany Benefits and people like Sean Ornstein, it makes it all work. So this time I'd like to bring up my dear friend to say a few words, Sean Ornstein. Sean, come on up here. We call this segment KTB Celebrates the BCA. So our first recognition goes out to Prime Design. Prime Design was named the number 30 on the list of top 100 owned businesses in the Philadelphia Business Journal, so congratulations to Maureen. <laughs> Tom Fee from Hayfleet Flanagan was recently honored by the Alzheimer's Foundation for all of his years of dedicated service, and he was given the opportunity to throw out the first pitch at a Philadelphia Phillies game in front of his friends and family and colleagues, and yes, he did make it across the plate, so. <laughs> Um, I was going to use a joke where I was going to repeat that whole thing again, but I thought that was not fair, but people don't, so. Okay. Um, Smart CEO. Uh, Smart CEO was named the Inc. 5000. They, were, they made the Inc. 5000 list now again for the third year in a row. So congratulations to Faye and the rest of your team. That's wonderful. <laughs> Governor Tom Corbett, he announced the appointment of accomplished and dedicated community leaders to serve and represent the interests of women and girls, and he appointed Sue Schick, who is our friend and CEO of United Healthcare, to um, he appointed her as the chair for the Pennsylvania Commission of Women. So that's that's really fantastic for Sue. <laughs> Phil Haregi uh, from Saber Systems and our good friend Jolene Jaworski. Where's Joe? She was walking around with a mitt somewhere. Um, she, uh, she recently joined the advisory council, both Phil and, and Jolene, recently joined the advisory council for Arcadia University's School of Global Business. So congratulations to those guys. Um, very impressive for PeopleShare, Ryan Clark and his whole team, they just opened up their 10th office a few weeks ago in Princeton, New Jersey, and they continue to grow and expand. And a lot of it's because of the wonderful relationships they made here at the BCA. So thank you to Ryan and congratulations on, on that wonderful achievement in your 10th office. That's awesome. <laughs> Titan 360 and Crafts Coaches, they've announced an official partnership making Titan the exclusive advertising concessionaire for Crafts Coaches. So that's great news for Titan and, and, and Crafts. That's, that's what it's all about, just building these business relationships and helping each other. That's kind of what we all do in the room. And, and I'm glad that, to hear that Titan and Crafts were able to put something together. Um, the last recognition goes out to two members from my KTV family, uh, both of whom I know will not be happy that I'm announcing this. Um, so the first is I want to congratulate Jen Fitchikowski. Jen was promoted this summer as our training and education coordinator, and she now has the, the distinct pleasure of helping KTV organize every single BCA event, meeting, phone call, <laughs> anything that goes on with the BCA, it's gonna be Jen Fidjikowski. So, Jen, thank you, congratulations. I see that dirty smile, are you, are you gonna kill me? She says no now, I'm in trouble later, I know that. Uh, I also, I also want to congratulate Bill Daggett. Bill's our CEO. Uh, Bill celebrated his 50th year at KTB this past July. And yes, he comes in every single day. <laughs> I uh, don't know what to do about that one, but he, uh, he celebrated 50 years. And, and that's an amazing, amazing accomplishment. 
to be in one place for that long 